EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. From fabled Riviera Country Club just west of Los Angeles, it's live second round coverage of the Genesis Invitational. Things starting to slowly take shape here on this Friday. For some, it is a race for the top prize. For others, it's a fight to stick around for the weekend as we show you the leaderboard. Our leader on this Friday is our featured golfer. He's got a two-shot advantage here to begin play. Wow, what a nice way to start the day, Frank. Straight out of the gate, and the barn door is officially open. Hmm, the speed was right what you want, but the eagle putt doesn't go down. A great opportunity here for Birdie. No problems there, that one in for a Birdie. And that'll put him at one under for his round and 14 under for the tournament. And this round starting off strong after the birdie at the first. This in the fairway at number two. I think I'd be fairly pleased with that, Frank. What do you think? I certainly do. It was so, so good. Okay, that one finished off. Four apart. And he's going to hold on to that three-shot lead. A reminder, coming up next week, we start the Florida swing with a stop at the Wetlands for the Florida Classic. Then it is on to Bay Hill for the Arnold Palmer Invitational leading up to that unofficial fifth major, the players at TPC Sawgrass. And a welcome back to Bermuda Grass, Rich. It's a totally different animal. Oh, and it's a narrow fairway here at three, but that'll be in a great spot. Second shot coming up. Let's check in for the first time with Notavigay the third. 148 yards left to the hole. Wind definitely hurting in his face. That's a good shot, and more importantly, too, a green in regulation, so birdie chance. Oh, yes! Can you please to get up that slope? It is in for a birdie. He moves to 15 under.
Okay, a little local knowledge there. He gets that ball to work back onto the green. And now a birdie putt coming up. Yeah, that's good putt. A birdie here at one to 16 under par. That will do just fine. He'll be factoring in this breeze in his face as he sets for a second. Ah, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. 14 feet to the hole. Oh, the pace perfect on that one. It's in for birdie. He moves to 17 under par. Yeah, that's how you take that bunker out of play. A super shot into this six green. Ah, nearly had it. Just going to wander a foot or so by. Safely in for par here at the sixth and he'll remain well in control of this tournament. Second shot coming up. Let's bring in Iona Steven. 131 yards to the front portion of the green. 136 all the way to the hole. Pin just on. And the pin, it's in the front portion of the green. Well, this is straight at it. It's a really good line. Oh, I always knew that was going to be a good shot when it left the club face. What's that? Eight or nine feet? Excellent shot. Hmm. Let's say he should have made that. That one finished off. It'll be a par here at seven. And he's going to maintain that substantial lead. This one starting up that left side. He just keeps motoring right along. Another good tee shot right there. Yeah, that's good shot. Decided to go for the right side fairway, and that's in good shape. Just 90 yards remaining here for his second into the par four.
Well, he'll be disappointed with that, no doubt. This yes, one didn't quite look right on that one. Okay, that in four part here at the eighth. And that's going to keep this large lead right where it is. Yeah, nothing to fault there. Good balance, good follow through, and a good start to this hole. From the fairway, we check in with Noda. Beautiful look at the ninth with the clubhouse in the background, but players beware, severely uphill. Whatever club you select, add one more. That's a good shot, and more importantly too, a green in regulation, so birdie chance. He has a 12-footer here. Oh, never in doubt. What a great putt that is. It's a birdie here at the ninth. And that is going to go in the books as a 30 on the front side. Five under par. Gotta think this an extra half club or more as he sets for a second into the wind. Chance now for another birdie. Okay, well done. A couple of birdies here sandwiched around the turn at 9 and 10. And he's now the leader by four here on this Friday. Looking for a strong finishing kick here on this Friday to get set up for the weekend and that another good drive here. That's a good shot. It is a giant green here at 11, but that ball safely aboard in two. This one gonna really test your distance control. Back up the hill for an eagle. Yeah, that's good pace. Just a little offline, but not too bad from that far away. You bet, a birdie here at the 11th. And he has now moved five clear of the field here in round two.
Everything flowing really well right now. Coming off three birdies in a row. Here's another solid tee shot as well. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. It's a very long putt, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult, uh, but he still has a shot to sink this one for birdie. Mm, good job to deaden it right by the hole, but he could not get it to go in. That one safely in. It's a par here at 12. And he'll stay at 20 under. Once again, another great tee shot. Uh, I'm starting to wonder how low can you go? And the driving has been simply superb. Now, Noda, his second from the fairway. 158 yards left to the hole. Swinging it great today. Would not surprise me if he stuck it close. Uh, that's not too bad. Good shot. Uh, inside 20 feet, I would imagine. So a good chance, really outside chance for Betty. Nah, the pace absolutely perfect there. Down the slope. It's in for a birdie. And he continues to just build up a massive lead for the weekend. That one, safely on the putting surface. He ran in a long one a moment ago. This equally long for another birdie. No. No issues there. It is a par here at 14. And he's gonna remain at minus 21. Looking for a strong finishing kick here on this Friday to get set up for the weekend and that another good drive here. This is where club selection is so important. Second shot into that stiff breeze. Just think about it. You, you've got to cover nearly two football fields of distance and get it inside five feet. You wouldn't think that's possible. Ah, yes, never in doubt. It's a birdie here at 15. And he's just continuing to pour it on here on this Friday. Okay, fortunate there. That ball hops onto the green, and he'll be left with that for his birdie. Now this for another birdie. Just has to get the ball started, and it will work back to the right and toward the hole. Mm, that's going to scoot a foot or two by. Okay, that'll be a par here at 16, and he'll stay at 22 under.
No issues here. That is into the fairway. It is one of the more satisfying shots in golf, isn't it? Down wind to a par five to second and then knock it on. Chance for eagle. Certainly shortens up the par five, that wind at your back, Rich, but you can just surf the wind. Just let that ball carry and just sail towards the green. Nope, didn't play enough of the break, and that'll be short as well. Nicely done. A birdie finished off here at 17. And he's going to move to 23 under par. Looking for a strong finishing kick here on this Friday to get set up for the weekend and that another good drive here. From the fairway, let's go to Noda. Tough not to get distracted with the majestic amphitheater setting here at the 18th at Riviera, but be mindful, you must land the ball left of the hole to get it close. Well, too bad, Frank. That one rolled right off the green. It's just coming out so hot. With all the elements of his game have been in sync today, a terrific shot right there. It's all about getting it inside that three-foot circle around the hole. That was a really nice shot. So will this be the week that our featured golfer claims that first ever title? Frank, it's looking promising through 36 holes. It is, and to just make that final leap to become a winner on the PGA Tour. Well, that's what's in front. It seems simple, but the last bit is the most difficult. So that's a wrap for all of us at EA Sports PGA Tour. Thanks for coming along. We'll see you next time on the road to the Masters.